Well, I'm going to step back a little bit. Englewood Mayor Michael Wilds, hi everybody. Victoria is one of my favorite people in City Hall. When she said, can I bring my family, I didn't know how beautiful this family was going to be. Half of Englewood. No, but I love it. And, I, I, and half of Elmore Street, right? It's, I'd love to know who everybody is. We're sharing this publicly with the community. This is September 11th. This is a historic time, a day of rejuvenation and love. And the fact that you have taken a day with such historic significance and you're attaching the notion of love to it is everything about Englewood. So please, if you don't mind, introduce each of you uh, to my lovely wife, Amy, and I, because we love to get to Hi. Okay? Hi. Not Hi. <laughs> please, start. Amy, you know me, Victoria. Hi, Victoria. <laughs> Bride. I'm the other bride. Sandy. Other friends of the, of the bride. The bride. Uh -huh. I'm Shamika. I'm Michael's sister. Please. I'm Lonnie. I'm friends with the bride and groom. I'm Greg Walker. This and is Anar Walker. Yay. And Zion Walker. Yay. <laughs> Brand new twins. That's great. I'm Adrian. Hi, Adrian. Adrian. I'm Michelle. I'm the bride. No, I'm sorry. I'm the groom's mother and the bride's mother in law. To me. Nice. <laughs> Congratulations. Brian, Thank you. I'm the cousin of the groom. I'm Anija Alina Sassi. Nice. I'm Maurice Slag. I'm the father of the groom and father in law. Father in law of the bride. Nice. And what's your name? What's your name? Dallas. Dallas? Dallas. Dallas. Wow, beautiful. Look how handsome Dallas looks. Hi. Hi. Dallas. Hi. Dallas. My mommy and daddy didn't invite me to their wedding. He's so lucky. This is his Gabby. Okay, I'm Gabby. Have? I'm the sister of the groom. And who's this? And this is my son Carter. Hello. I'm Kiana, sister of Victoria and the bride's aunt. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, and I could say that we are all so happy to be able to share in this joyous occasion with you. Thank you for having us. Oh, it's our pleasure. Thank you. Okay, Michael, do your thing. Do my thing. Yes. Listen, we're living through extraordinary times. Yes. And the way I got through this, my wife and I became grandparents twice in the last three months. Oh, wow. wow. And we married off a daughter in between. Oh, and I have to tell you, that kind of, that kind of energy keeps me going. And Got this kind of snapshot, the photo that I'm seeing of you guys keeps me going. So I'm going to say something to you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you for choosing me. Thank yeah. you for choosing our home. And next Thank time, you. bring a bathing suit because you're welcome. Our home is your home. <laughs> I don't know who's getting married. And I just don't want anybody <laughs> falling in by accident. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you like that? Yeah. <laughs> Carter just my first I'm ready. He was ready. Right, so we're going to get started now. Yes. Anyway, we, we know in these extraordinary pandemic times that it doesn't make a difference what kind of building of brick and mortar we stand in front of. Really what's important is in our heart. And God has graced you both with a beautiful child, and you've now decided to spend the eternity of your life together. And it's a real honor for me to be the officiant at this occasion. Elena and... Michael, you know that a marriage is a commitment to love one another, to realize what's in your rearview mirror, but to realize whatever brought you to this journey, you're embarking on a new journey together. It's a marriage that requires faith, faith in not knowing what lies ahead of you. It's a marriage that requires love, love to love somebody you may disagree with. And if you disagree, to show the same respect to one another, that you would want yourself to enjoy. I often acquaint the marriage like two woven threads that come together and they form a beautiful tapestry. And like time, when a person travels over a rug, it gets more brilliant, it gets more colorful. And that's our prayer to you, that what brought you today to my home will bring you only health and happiness going forward and that the challenges that you have will be met amply 
by having love for one another and this gorgeous family that you bring forward so that the problem of one will be solved by another and vice versa. And that's how we as a nation, we as a community are going to get through everything that we get through by doubling down on love. And I'm so humbled really by this and to see it, knowing it. I have a 30 year marriage myself and it still feels new. And you chose a date in September 11, which has great historic significance to embark on this journey. And these new beginnings, making September 11th an eternal day of happiness in your home and an anniversary is something that really is a humbling experience. Michael, do you take Elena to be a lawful wedded wife? Yeah. To love her, comfort her, honor her, keep her in sick with her from this day forward? Yeah. Elena, do you take Michael to be a lawful wedded husband? Yeah, I do. To honor him, keep him in sickness and health from this day forward? Yeah. Does somebody have a lifeguard? <laughs> Does somebody have a ring? Who has the ring? Dallas, Dallas you have the rings? Yeah, come here, Dallas. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Marriage is a good thing. You're not supposed to be Here, spit it. Here. Give it to mommy and daddy. Give it to mommy and daddy. Okay? Good. Wow. Good boy. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> No, it's okay. You can go to the stage for it. No, it's okay. Your daddy's gonna be crying soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh, that's a beautiful moment. We know. brand new babies and we have older people who understand the inevitability and the circle of respect, dignity, and the happiness that a family is drawn to. It's our prayer that you will only be able to continue to hold hands and enjoy good experiences as you build your continued family in the city of Englewood. By the authority vested in me by the great state of New Jersey and the city of Englewood, I declare your husband and wife. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs>